fission as in nuclear, okay? All right. Fission of neurons singing pharmaceutical jazz. I am chemically altered. Thank you, Eli Lilly, and my esteemed contagion of AMA-approved psychiatric professionals that I say out of my mind, hogtied to a delicate imbalance, dropperful of clarity, pale liquid appropriate for the condition. Oh, what am I to do? Do, do, do. What am I to do when my mind turns screws of apocrypha? into fail-safe truths, the way a face just sets, concerned and distant while I babble and babble. I can't take this. I can't stand that. My face frightens me, purple and loud. I would not want to know her. The girl called herself Diana Nightingale. Diana Frecklewitz Nightingale laughed her parents, trying to make her stop wanting to be someone else. I am the son of all my experience, insight, interaction with life. Four, my maternal grandmother, Sarah Eva Ely Ramsey Walser, with her Hudson Seal coat and straight, straight seams, smoking cools down to the filters, taught me the finer ice picks of womanhood. Saturdays, when my brother went to track meets with dad, she and I, and usually my mother, had tea at the Bullock's Wilshire Tea Room, where I chewed and swallowed cinnamon toast and an endless parade of crustless petite sandwich with white cotton gloves in my lap Sheet blonde women like my mother, dreaming of Grace Kelly, stopped by our table modeling St. John knits or black and pink Chanel suits, whispering, this can be found in the French room on the second floor. My nose was too big, my hair too brown and curly for the place with its watered silk drapes and rose-strewn carpet, the chicken salad and tomato aspic. But she has such nice, nice posture, don't you think? My mother, ever the WASP, would say, smoothing the pink organza on my spun glass dress. Helen, the child is perfect. I'll take her if you can't get a hold of yourself and that other girl of yours. Dominion over the primitive in all our lives is the Jesus principle. She's a good girl, aren't you, darling? She looks just like me. I told her we could be twins, and I chewed and chewed, but did not dip my toast in the hot chocolate, a lady. I did not spot the dress I could wear 10 times before it was washed. My grandfather, Frederick Ramsey, my mother's father, committed suicide when she was seven. Some say because of the depression and no work. Some say because of Sarah Eva Ely Ramsey Walser and fear five. I guess you could say I know a lot about fear, knuckle bone and murder in my own bed, fear of failing and falling six. Funny how failure and falling sound alike, the firing failing and falling, bling, bling, bling in my brain, my managed care brain, my climate controlled brain, that friction and fission sound alike is funny, this friction and fiction sound alike, ha ha. Seven, the friction of my life against my life is my life. The vision of my life, despite my life, is